know you stay up right here. Oh, yeah. Remember, I had, I had one. I think it was this one that you wanted. This one. Yeah, that's the one. Hello. Man, what you like to drink? What you like to drink? Literally, like walking distance from the house. For real, man. I drink. The homies. Sponsored by Modelo. Yeah. You got the coordinate. You got the coordinate. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Hey, shit, where we on? 11? Yep. Shout out to Modelo, man. Shout out. We recording already? Yeah, yeah. Oh, damn it. Hey, guys. He's trying to hide the beer. Not me. I already posted this early. Early. Get the conversation aside. That's a rare occasion. You said this is 11? This is not a rare occasion. I drink all the time. I wish I had two of them so I could clash them like uh, Stone Cold. Stone Cold! <laughs> The homies. The homies. The homies. Yeah, exactly. That's what we got to do. <laughs> no, we we got to get a homies 316 shirt. Ooh. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Episode 11, Episode man. Episode 11. Weekly wrap up, baby. Weekly wrap up. Bye, homies. Bye, homies. That's always die. Bye, homies. That's Bye, homies. Bye, homies. Bye, homies. Bye, homies. Shot the press is Bucks vs. Suns. You want to get a quick dive on that? Let's do it. Shouts out to Drew Holiday, man. He's he's balling. Do you believe that was a foul? Is he balling? Oh, uh, uh, Devin Booker. No, it's just no, an it aggressive wasn't. play. He is that. Uh, it's a good aggressive play. It's okay, Kyle. I mean, if he, 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 if it kind of, the different book, it kind of. I, don't, like I just don't want the Bucks to win. I want CP3 to get him one. Yeah, I want CP3 hard. to get him one. He did the ball a little harder than. Yeah, I finished. Because uh, Drew Holiday been having him under his, under his <laughs> wing. No. Dog. That's what they did. The first, Holiday, in the first no. two games, they Blue put Holiday then stepped his game up this year. They put him against Devin Booker, and He's then nice they were like, you know what? We're going to switch this around and put you on CP3. Ever since they did this, they've been bought. Like, CP3's been CP3 off his game. CP3 is still kill that nigga. Stop it. Why you ain't killing them? I mean, he's a ball. Why you ain't killing them? He had them 13, uh, 13 last game. I forgot how many in this game. Why you ain't killing them? I want to see them close it out. I want to see the Bucks close it out because if they don't, I think they lose the series. If they don't win this next Tonight, game, right? I think they or, lose the series. What is it, Tuesday? They're playing more. Hey, man, if they do win, just say I called in on one of these previous episodes. I literally said step that, that, the, <laughs> that if they get that. past the Bro Brooklyn Knicks, they just going to win the whole thing. I yeah, called that shit. That. Yeah, it, right. it would suck if Giannis don't win the ring. Like, why? Uh, why you you like him that much? I don't. I don't really care I'm, for him. I'm saying it'll suck because of all the shit he's been talking. Like, you don't remember him saying like King me, King me. Like when he was playing against that. LeBron. Oh shit! I'm saying like, yeah, I, it'll it'll. It'll hurt. Yeah. Man, he's like, hurt. he don't got no bag, though. All he has is like a like, yeah, no bag. Hey, no, he got no post moves. Where, where do you want to start? But was it Bucks? You yeah, start with the Bucks. He did something LeBron didn't do. Oh my God! Here we go. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> ooh, look at Will. Oh. What about that? Uh, here uh, comes uh, the like that shit. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, Tim? Uh, uh, Channel Nine News reporting. Hey, Tim, 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 he, he, he stayed through it all. You have something Last to say, James Household? But you know what though? His <laughs> owners put a team around him. Uh, Thank you. Thank so, you. so, so, who was the second best player on the Cleveland Cavaliers teams back then when they were losing? No, okay, Chris Middleton. He did, he did he get drafted <laughs> by the Bucks? Yes, he did. And okay, but he involved into that player. But did so he have that's Mo not like that's like, like you got drafted by a player. Yeah, he had Mo Woods, but I won't even say Mo yeah, Woods was the second best player. player. Well, look, but he had the offense. Bro. Statistically, he was the second best player. I say it was a Zouse. I said Larry Hughes like that first year. Yeah. I say it was a Zouse. Did he have Barry Zouse then? Yeah, no, he yeah 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 yeah, yeah. yeah he had Virgil after his out. Man, did he but feel like he had one more? No, he me, had both of them when I, they went I, to I the finals. I thought Giannis needed another yeah, player around right. him in order to win. Nah, he didn't play. Shaq was old. He did have Shaq for a minute, right? Yeah, Shaq was old. But yeah. let's, let's not act like. Look, hold on, man. I know you didn't say Shaq. He did play with him. He did. He did. But Shaq was oh, that was fall on the ground. Shaq could be on the ground for two possessions. Shaq. Okay. He was tired. No, no disrespect, Shaq. Yeah, Come I think on, that's man. fine, Will. Just hit the little button. Anyways. Thank you, bro. You are right. 
and he proved me wrong on that. You, you he, were right. He didn't if, switch team. If now that I want to see him close had, it out. He had the chance to. I want to see him close it out now. I always say that's so great. The new yeah. NBA <laughs> deserves it. Yeah, to who, yeah. Like, man, yeah. I, um, I, I think CP3 needs to go ahead and get it. But I mean, I don't, I don't blame nobody in the league for switching up and going anywhere and doing anything. I used to be like, man, that's weak. No, no team, no organization is loyal. In this day and age, it used to be on some. Yeah. All right, we got you. We riding to the I mean, wheels Dallas. fall off. This and this and this. Dallas, yeah, he, Dallas. Dallas does have a family vibe. At least yeah. the Mavs. Cowboys. Yeah, but I mean, you can. The you Lakers can, with Kobe. Still to this day, I mean, but that's the yeah. last of the Mohicans. Who, yeah. The last one to do it is what? Udonis has them. Yeah. But there's a lot of players uh, that aren't loyal either, though. Well, yeah, Dallas Dallas that's right. But it, it's no, somewhat loyal to the Heat, I guess. Right. But now they yeah. have. But. No team is loyal to any player. You could be here one day okay. and be traded the next. When LeBron, when LeBron was with Cleveland, weren't they? Wasn't Cleveland trying to give him the most out of any team? But yeah, but they didn't. No, they, they weren't trying to give no him, team around him. Give him the most money. This what they told LeBron was, all right. He said, I need a team. I need. A, I want to go. Yeah. I need you to go out and go get players. We need more players. We need more players. For a while, the reason why him and the front office was like going back and forth and getting into it was. They didn't want to go get nobody. They're like, well, this is the first time in years we had so much going on in Cleveland. We got like, we're making so much revenue. Hey, off it don't matter if we win or it don't matter if we win or lose. We're, we're making, making money. money. Yeah, we're making money. Pay we're, him a little they more. Needed he needed money. Slow. Exactly. They needed money to bring somebody else in. He should have took the Tom Brady effect. Uh, <laughs> yep. Nah, nah. If he really wanted to win, right they then, win. they should have took the Tom Brady effect. They Tom down, Brady down, is top six, six, or is it seven? I six, I think. He won six, six with New England. Six, six, six with New England. So you got seven you got times. Times. They went and got Leon. When he said, I need help, they went and got Leon Pope. Yeah. <laughs> he said, I need Ooh. help. But he didn't say, hey, take some of this money off of mine to go I and get a did. top no, notch player. He did take a pay cut. He did take a pay cut. He did take a pay cut. I think if you out of his rookie point, contract, he did. He, did. he did take a pay cut. He went to Miami and got the max. He didn't have the max at, at Cleveland. When they're he was but they were trying to give him the max whenever he was right, trying to re-sign with it. But they, they didn't want to build no team around him. Okay, so who was these players okay. going to be? Who so wanted to go to Cleveland? It, exactly. <laughs> hey, he, he, he went right back. Three yeah, years yeah, later. Yeah, yeah. But, but what they had, they had key players he had that they had drafted. He, he, and they picked up Kevin Love. He had to be like, a champion I want to what you want. He had to be a champion yeah, first. He had to go exactly. to college. Like I say, he had to go to college. <laughs> And, and then, uh, you know, yeah. you said loyalty. Loyalty is is, is is broad because, I mean, yeah, everybody wants to be loyal. But where is the competitiveness? True. Yeah. True. Staying somewhere and building. Building. Like, yeah. Taking hey, your L's. I don't want to. I don't want to play, play with Michael Jordan. Hey, you got to give D. Lil his respect. I want to beat him. He's even getting beat up the last couple of years. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, yeah. like, uh, that shit ain't fun. That shit ain't fun. It's All right, not listen. Fun. You're right. Listen, it's well, not fun. It's an old verse that say, uh, yeah, Damian Lillard, they saying he going to ask for a trade. I think he's no, out of there. No, he didn't. He, I, he didn't ask true. for a trade, but I, I think he's out of there. But you got to think about it. They're going to bring somebody in. If I have to go through the Celtics, if, if, if I'm in? sitting over here saying, "All right, I'm about to be loyal. I'm about to be competitive." Who would play And I got to go against Ray Allen. I got KG, and I got a Rondo. A young Rondo. Step your game right. up. Is he 20th? Oh, my God. He's Tuck, step hey, your Tom game Brady did Step your game up. Get, get in the gym. Basketball. Get in the gym. But that also, I can get in the gym. The front office is important in that. General management. Yeah, exactly. You got it. <clears throat> go I but get, I agree. I can get in the gym all I agree with staying somewhere and trying to just go harder. Just go harder. Because, I, I mean, they talk about So, let me ask you. You don't think that LeBron is one of the most hardest working players in the NBA? LeBron works hard. I think you know what I'm saying. LeBron works hard. The boy puts a million dollars into his body every summer. He's a hard worker. Right. It got cool to switch teams when Kevin Durant did it. Mm. No, I mean, he that people did. I mean, we, uh, people want to say LeBron did, did it first. LeBron didn't do it first. No. Yeah, I mean, Gary Payton. And I feel like the Supersonics had a little bit of a super team. Celtics. Yeah, Celtics definitely did it first. Not did it first. Mm. You want to Would you consider Kobe and Shaq a super team? <clears throat> no, I mean, no. during that time, it was like uh-huh. dynamic duos. Like, but see, know, Shaq like left Orlando and went to the Lakers, and duo. everybody don't even bring that up. And he wanted to ring with them. 
I mean, but at the same strategy. time, he yeah, went, yeah, he went, him, him, and, him, him and, uh, he went for Penny. the money, though. Yeah, he went, he, yeah. he didn't know Kobe and, was going to be Kobe. And, and yeah, Kobe, but that's what Kobe I'm saying, though. Then. He, no, he, no, he, no. he didn't, he didn't want to stick it out with Orlando. Oh, it was, what, one or two years? No, it was one year. Kobe got there before. Kobe came to the next year. Yeah, Kobe was there before, uh, before Kobe, uh, No, Shaq was there before Kobe got there. No, that was his rookie. Did y'all see Space Jam 2? Yeah. I yeah. haven't finished it. You know, it takes me three three days to watch a movie. For a kids' movie, it's not bad. Yeah, LeBron didn't work on his acting though. Yeah, he <laughs> didn't <laughs> do the original. Yeah. Uh, it's, not, not, it's, it's not supposed to be the original. It's nothing. It's no, nothing. No, 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 let me ask you this. It. I haven't seen it yet. Was down. Michael Jordan acting good? No, no, he's not an actor. <laughs> All right, LeBron. <laughs> I never yeah. said nothing about the acting of LeBron. I, say, I mean, yeah. Space Jam the original is a classic, of course, but this for these okay. gener- this generation is for them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I feel yeah, like it's it was for the kids. Have you seen the kids? Well, I've also, seen some of it. Yeah. I mean, I ain't seen it for a movie. Do your kids watch Bugs Bunny? Nobody watched Looney Tunes no more. Oh jeez, man! Yeah, I watched exactly. It. So it was like people were saying it's for kids. It's for kids. It's like it was supposed to pull like the adults. It was supposed, it was to, pull supposed everybody. to pull the kids. I mean, what right. you kind of did for, bro? Yeah, they're probably marketing towards the adults to take the kids. Yeah, you know, to kind of restart yeah. that. Exactly. Yeah. But I mean, I, I mean, I could put Bugs Bunny in front of uh, Drew, and she'll be like, uh, Bunny Rabbit. Yeah, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I mean, and then Puppy Dog Pal. Nobody yeah. knows. <laughs> These kids nowadays don't know who Yosemite Sam. Man, man they just don't know, man. man. But who brought that though? Is. They don't know what good. It's it's, man, it's say. YouTube and diluted everything, yeah. bro. Man. It's a whole new answer. But I want to say whenever I whenever I do have kids or if man, I what they gonna be watching Boomerang? They gonna, they gonna, <laughs> what they, you talking no, about? No, my kids gonna be watching anime at a young age. Yeah, anime. yeah. straight anime. Yep, I'm putting on an early anime Avatar, you know, something like that. Avatar's not anime, but it, it but they do adopt that. It's edging. It's it, it edged. It, it, yeah, it edged. It edged. That's why I said early on. It, like truth be told, for a cartoon, a lot of people do consider it. Like everybody, a lot of people look at that as an anime. There's gonna be some anime people be like, oh, ooh, he said Avatar. <laughs> Avatar do go hard though. My, my daughter's you don't in think anime, Avatar but I'm not, anime, I'm not though? An anime though. I'm still, I'm still trying anime? to. Yeah, Avatar is not anime. It's not considered anime. It's tough. It's considered a book, but it's not considered a manga. Hmm. I don't know about that shit. Yeah, yeah. I don't either. Yeah. It's a deep dive. It's a deep dive. Yeah. Sailor Moon. Sailor Moon is an anime. It's a classic, and it still is thriving today. Yeah, that's what that's what my daughter's on right now. Yeah, right now, yeah. Sailor Moon. Mm-hmm. Man, Sailor Moon is one of the OGs that put anime on. I was gonna say, like, where were we on? Like, Darkwing Duck. Dark Wings does not anime, but well, no. Okay, no, so we're, I'm we're thinking just like, like old school cartoons. Cartoon. Old school cartoons, yeah. Mighty Dark Wings, Dark So the Mighty Ducks, oh, Street Sharks, Street Sharks. Goddamn, I watched Static Shock. It's so different. You ever watched the old Transformers, like the 3D one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What, with one, the one with their animals too. Yeah, yeah. 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 One was a cheetah. One was a like. It's a so dinosaur. different. Man. I was on like Animaniacs to yeah. Or be, yeah. be, what's that? Beetle Celebrity Deathmatch? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That, was, that was fire. Yeah, oh. Celebrity Deathmatch was fire. Boondocks. Boondocks is great. I don't yeah. give a damn. That was my shit. But, but you know, you know, you know, know that the creator of Boondocks based it off of anime, too. Really? Yeah. It's got the, no, especially the intro. Yeah, it's supposed to have an anime kind of feel because mm-hmm. yeah. yeah, like, like, he based it off. Like, he yeah. wanted, he what, said he wanted to makes, try to adopt that culture. What is the, uh, Qualifications to be an anime. I don't get it. Like, well, it has a, it start off as a manga first, and uh, what's a manga? It has a, a manga is, is considered like a book, like a comic book in a sense. Okay. Okay. Uh, but it's like a Japanese font to style, and you read you read from uh, right to left, to so left to right. Uh, okay. I went and got some fun last night, and we found this new spot for y'all to go to in Arlington, right down the street from his house. Bet say less. Yeah. Nice. I love fun. I don't even feel it, so I never had it. They brought the uh, beef this time on the plate. Yeah. You know, sometimes they, they bring it to you in the soup and yeah. you just throw it in because it just cooks it because the broth is so hot. I was like, what? I was sick one time when yeah, I was working so at a uh, movie Oh, yeah, tavern. so good when you sick. Shout out to Movie oh, Tavern in Beverly. I, I was working there and. Um, I was, kinda, I was under nah, it was, nah, nah this was the, this is they like, went out in the front there. This is the, uh, this is the uh, dine in. It was like my first time seeing like the food inside. Like you got the food inside the theater, yeah. and I, I was working like there. Studio movie, yeah, and, uh, yeah. yeah. You get a this is this like the first one. This is like the first one in the DFW, the one in Bedford. Yeah, that one was classic. Uh, box of candy, it's a popcorn. So, um, what you talking about? What, what was it? Um, I was I was a little sick, and my manager was like, man. My manager Danny was like, man, I'm about to order some 
fold for you, bro. I was like, what it'll clear you up. It was like, fuck, bro. It drained everything. And that jalapeno in there is like the hottest Ooh. jalapeno I've ever had in my life, Man. bro. Every time. It's bomb. I got to be full, But too. the thing is, I don't really get sick like that, so I don't be... Like, I mean, you don't have to be sick, bro. You don't have to be sick. Yeah, it's good, it's good, bro. Yeah, it just drains you out. I'm gonna have to fuck with it one time, one time. No, for real. You got to. It's so good. Full review. Yeah, yeah. 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 Hit us up and let us know what's There's the good best Faux, okay Yeah. Faux, we'll do that Faux, 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 did you see that clip of him and uh, Kanye in the studio and Kanye has like a full mask on and shit? Yeah, he's rocking that mask for a second. I think he's like, like that. They do that with Batman. He's like, you can't even see him. It's so yeah. funny. Kanye Kanye maybe this week I've been jamming uh, Boosie's Go, uh, Go Talk 3. It came out Friday. It's pretty, it's pretty dope. I got to check it out, man. I got to check it out. Um, man, man. A lot of people have been talking about how Lil Wayne's been on a run. Have y'all been keeping yeah. up? Yeah. I, I heard he's fucking... Someone tried to create him with Lil yeah. Wayne that showed you in uh, Vegas, yo. Yeah, oh, yeah, that shit was fire. Yeah. New I heard he's going to do a Washington shit. remix. Yeah. yeah. I think Money Back Yo tweeted something. He said yeah, he said he's going to put him on, on, on the Washington Do we need another Lil Wayne album? album? Or, or yes. Uh, Think so? Yes, I, I want so the old Lil Wayne album, yeah. so I don't want this new shit. Yeah, I want the old Lil Wayne. Honestly, bro, I think it would be cool. I want the straight bars and bars on bars on bars. I think it would be, be cool like, to like, get, like everything. five tracks, but like, all one. But it just Like how you went in yeah. on fucking like, like Sam Green. One like, Cause one yeah, Sam Green, he has like one of the best long. verses of 2021. Say I'm lying. No, I, I bro, think they say it was the fifth uh, verse. I think that's like the top. To be honest, I think that's like the number one. He was mad. He, he was a uh, video, yeah. right? So that far, far and they all killed it. But Lil Wayne verse on there was yeah. just fire. Because you know how Wayne can hit the highs and lows really good. Like he picks yeah. his, like that "Shoot Me Down," like all those songs that we used to talk about. Mm -hmm. You know, at the office pods, how he would like change the pace of the album so much. I think he could put a 20 minute album together and breeze, like you just listen to it, breeze through it, and not even fucking know. Genius, bro. Genius. I think it would be fire. Yeah. When, when, when he dies, they got Hey, why'd you win. think of the cartoon is my break. favorite album, though? And, and I, I said Carter Bro, I would have guessed the exact same thing. I would have said Carter 3 too. I, I mean, I, I fuck with it, but. Bro, that was the same. That was the same like, was but that was in a time of my life where it was a lot going on, bro. It's a different genre, though. Nothing was the same. It's not his best album. It's Take Care. I don't care what nobody say. Take Care is a great album. Take Care. Nothing was the same. Okay, statistically, yes. Take Care. Listen, I would take care of the numbers. I kind of think it's going hard. Views and numbers, but take care when. I right, was up there with was Carter too. I mean, Carter three. Right, right. another day I was in my feelings. I put on the jungle. I was like, oh man. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, like, she from the jungle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. <laughs> that little lump in your throat. Yeah. I'm like, oh, oh man. <laughs> 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 nah, but uh, another one the same. It was just a time of my life. I just. That yeah. was a great album. But yeah. the views are had. I'm running. No, that was if if you mean this is too late. Never mind. Yeah. Uh, views at that uh at that uh. Western Troll. Western Road. Yeah, yeah, Western Road. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh! Fire. Redemption. Ooh, the redemption. Fire and Desire. Man. Um, yeah, that was a dope album. But I saw that Feel No Way. Feel No Ways. Yeah. Uh, bro, I see I missed a lot of that way. If you're reading this, it's too late. I kind of missed some of that. I, I mean, I heard the hits. But, yeah, because Run Through the System of My Woes is uh, yeah. iconic. But take care. Every time I come on, I get turned up. I think Drake is at his best when he's just talking shit. Yeah. Like, yeah, when well, I'm not, sure, like, yeah. it's, he's rapping, but he's talking shit. Like, just, just talking slick. shit. And that's yeah. why he's flexing, really. That's yeah. what he's doing. Yeah, he's flexing. flexing. Like, because y'all want to talk hard. shit. Whoa. And I'm just. Yeah. Well, he's, com he's comfortable. He's got yeah. his, you know, he's got his square. Yeah. He's, he's good. Who's that? Drake. Drake. Oh, the guy that got the bills right. <laughs> I did hear yeah. some. The other oh, day, man, here we go. No, man. I did. I did I mean, see something true. on uh, B High ATL. This guy that does podcasts in Atlanta, and it said that Kia Shine gets every time Best I Ever Had is like sampled or used. Kia Shine gets royalties from that because I guess the baby am I ever, no, 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 no. he had those like first four bars that he wrote, and a song that he gave to Wayne. Wayne got the song. Drake heard it, and then they kind of flipped it into Best I Ever Had. I'm not. I'm not partaking in this conversation. It's crazy. I mean, I'm not it, I wouldn't discredit this whole thing. It's just an interesting little hip hop fact. 
Like that that uh, Ten bands too. That Nicki Minaj, mm -hmm. uh, that song that just dropped that I think sampled best I ever had. And he was mm -hmm. talking about how his royalties started kicking back in for that because he's got that publishing from those first four bars or whatever. I don't think it discredits Drake. It's just interesting. But those I four just, bars, the first four, are the hardest I, four to come I, up I with. I just too. feel like and that sets the tone. <laughs> song for song, people know though. You can take okay the songs that people say that he got from somebody else. You can just take those out. He still got a million fucking He's songs good, that will smash anybody. What is that? Five p.m. in New York. I mean, you can tell you about that. Shit. Yeah, you know. Just like when Meek Mill said, "Oh yeah, I know you wrote. I know you wrote that. I know you wrote that uh, song. back to back." Yeah, he was like, yeah, I know you wrote that one, uh, but they still fire. I mean, he's, he's, I mean, you can't really discredit his whole thing, but it is. When is now, it, when, when is say when, bro? Now, he went in on that song. The same guy did say Wayne is a thousand percent real across the board. No, you know, he's in there rapping. I go hard. I'm just tired of him singing. When he raps, that's when I like him. That's for a different hey, audience. Hey, so I seen this thing, it was like, Drake sounds like y'all know who Craig David is. Nah. Mm -hmm. Y'all know who Craig David is. Nah. Uh, come on. I am. Oh, you know who Craig David is? I think I remember who Craig David is. Is it the, from from the UK? Nah. Uh, he wore a little box, right? Uh, not like like a little light fro. Light fro. And then sometimes they got like a little twist or whatever. Yeah, Craig. David. Yeah, here, I'm gonna I'm gonna play some Craig David. Y'all gonna play some Craig David? <laughs> they said. Uh, Craig David was hot in the nineties. Like oh, in, the, okay. in the 90s, he was yeah. he was hot. What what was his genre of music? R and B. R and B. Yeah, R &B. yeah uh, he had this one song. Yeah, don't 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 uh, don't fill me fill me in and um damn, what's Any up? collaboration what's with somebody we might know? <laughs> no, I, I, he's a DJ now. He's a DJ now and he's hot like in Miami. Like, but they're saying that Drake wants to sound like Craig David when he sings. Because Craig David can sing. But y'all also like his harmonize like you can harmonize really good. And like when you hear him, you're gonna be like, that's exactly where we're drunk. Okay, if he get uh inspiration from somebody, There's why the fuck does that matter? I didn't say it mattered, but it uh, is an interesting the, the, little caveat. The the, the, I mean, the how is parallel? I mean, it sound like it's like parallel. It's like I mean, but just look, think about it. But Drake is good at taking people's uh, styles and flows and making it his own and making it iconic. Look at what he did with the the uh, excess I was gonna flow. say you remember all that triple X beef? That yeah, was like, because you know he was supposed to do that. So he was supposed to do a song with triple X, and then he ended up he just going to jail. Yeah, he was like, well, I'm just gonna use your flow. Yeah, and I'm gonna make make them flow well, like where your pants is like my flow better. Um, it's a song he did with a UK artist, wasn't it? Man, I can't even remember, bro. I can't even remember. That's it's getting a little messy. Yeah, <laughs> but he he go he goes jet like the same cadence that yeah. Triple X has. It's the same exact cadence that Drake went with and fucking wrecked that shit. And I wonder if like subconsciously that's why people give Jay Z and like Lil Wayne so much credit. Like Andre 3K is because they're like, their styles are their styles. Yeah, it's like, just, like, like you know it's them. Yeah. yeah. It's weird. Yeah. And so many people try to copy their styles and don't have success with but, it. But, I mean, that, that, that's how you, you learn from the past, right? The people that was before you. Oh, right? yeah. I mean, it's, a, it's always an evolving thing. I mean, shit. It's a bunch of motherfuckers that try to rap like B. But yeah. can they keep it? There's a bunch right. of people try to rap like Wayne, and some of them have had a little success, but they can't copy everything that Wayne Shout does. Shout out to little Twist, man. I, I heard anybody that, yeah, <laughs> that he need to, like, try to rap like Biggie, though. Like, yeah. I, I don't think I ever heard, like, as far as Nobody sound, tells stories anymore. Nope. Yeah, That's true. Exactly. I've stories. been on a deep dive. Well, well I mean, J, J. Cole does. Eminem still tells stories. Um, yeah. you know who I like to tell whoa, stories? Whoa, 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 hold on. Yeah, what did you say about J. Cole? Cole? Oh, about J. Cole. I was about to say, I'm J. Cole, like really? Story he be telling stories. Who? No, I just not I like to do like, Pac would just, yeah. like, he'd encompass the whole thing, bro. Yeah. Man, bro, I, I, I got all the Pac on my Apple music, bro. I be listening to I've been on a deep dive on that Napoleon dude. He did an interview with, like, I think it's Art of Dialogue or some YouTube channel, bro. He had given it up. He's got some badass Pac stories, like, about how when he got shot, they put him on the first floor so people could see through his window. So they had to back a van up and like do mm, shifts of yeah. security and like it was crazy, bro. Speaking of rappers, what, what y'all think about Blueface fighting this? You, uh, this <laughs> what are you talking about? Hey, hey I don't see the clip of him. He look like he throwing hands though, bro. Who? Bro. Blueface. I mean, I just seen a clip <laughs> on Instagram. Hold on, I he was beating somebody up. Terrible. <laughs> I was like, he was punching on something. I was like, oh. 
It looked like he, he is fight, lanky, he looked, though. Like, he, he looked like he's fighting lanky. Bird from a uh, high school basketball team. Yeah, like, uh, Black Bird. <laughs> I'm not <laughs> saying he can like yeah. fight, fight, but I'm just saying the clip I seen looked like he was uh, meleeing on somebody. Video of him sparring. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, and it's trash. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it's straight up. Man, I'm not anticipating no celebrity fights anymore, man. I, I it's wack, just bring bro. celebrity deathmatch back, man. Yeah, yeah. Just yeah. Put, put it to rest. 2021. Yeah, arm wrestler or something. Yeah. Hey, y'all think Jake Paul gonna uh, wanna do good against Tyron Woolley? Mm, I've never seen Tyron Woolley no, fight. So I, I, I didn't know I think, he was I think 40. He will. I didn't know no, he was like 40. I, I think Ty, I think Jay, Jay, uh, Jay Paul is gonna uh, Listen, beat Tyron. when are we just gonna open up our eyes and we'll see that they're just going, they just hype everything up. They, they, I mean, they found a nucleus. They're picking their fights. They, they, they found a nucleus of, of how they can make money. Yeah. Is exactly. that what? Let's just hype this shit up. Let's just hype this shit up. Let's just hype this shit up. And let me talk some shit. Let yeah. me talk some shit. Let me antagonize all these other motherfuckers. And then I'm going to fight somebody and I'm yeah. horrible. <laughs> like, I'm horrible. But wait, Jake Paul's not really right horrible. He, he, he's not horrible. <laughs> and Tyron Willie is an established fighter. Yeah, he, and he's, yeah. a, he's a very expensive. Yeah, he's yeah. a former yeah. champion. Very expensive. For years. The Paul brothers are like, horrible. Had, no. <laughs> Jake, Jay, Jay Paul is not a horrible guy. fighter. I'm yeah. sorry. He's not. Well, he got good power. And, oh, I don't want to scale to one to ten. Well, like, where, where does he range? Ten being uh, the best, seven. one being the, being the up. Uh, I say he's like a six. Six, seven. I'm being honest. Six, seven, bro. He's like a three. Like, like no. Alex, okay. We're going to ask the boxing expert here. I'm going on what I see. I'm going on what I see. The same way that we see difference in jump shots, he probably sees in there. The what do you think? I would say he's about a five. If you think about, it, look, Floyd Mayweather. How many fights does Jake Paul have? That's true. He's he, made he, ten he, more. He, had, he has yeah. three. If you look at Floyd Mayweather's career, look at his first five fights. Look at Muhammad Ali, Ali's first five fights. Look at Julio Cesar Chavez, his first like thirty fights. Sips beer. They're against <laughs> fucking uh, Trat. Like uh, garbage man, yeah. <laughs> they're against nobodies. Okay, and they, they they've had the record because they have to get the experience as they're moving up the ranks. Jake okay. Paul, he's getting experience, but he's getting it with high. He's getting big money for his low experience. That's why he did a YouTuber first, then he went to an, an actual athlete, Nate Robinson. Okay, then he went to an actual fighter, Ben Askren. Now he's going. For a a kind of an actual okay. striker. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Champion, next the, last, the, last fight, the last fight was an MMA fighter, right? Yes. Willie's okay. an MMA fighter. Yeah, okay. Willie's an MMA fighter. But look, fighter. another thing but is, Willie's good at you're, gonna, you're gonna say, hey, why isn't he fighting a boxer? But in reality, he can go fight a boxer uh, as his first pro debut, and that boxer can only been boxing for a month. No, you're you're right. That's you're right. You're right. So, but for the amount of shit that's being, the, for the amount of shit that's being taught. Like for you to go on TV and say, you know what, I can fight Canelo in three years. Of course you can fight Canelo in three he, years. Yeah, and get your ass whooped. Yeah, exactly. exactly. But he's he's, he's but he's but, he, but he's go, to he's actually gonna he's, go he's more to where he's gonna make the okay. money. And okay, so, try so to do okay, it. so if if he loses a fight, if he loses a fight from here to to the next three years, does he even deserve a chance to even climb the ladder like that? It, it ain't gonna happen if yeah. he loses the fight. That's okay. why he's gonna do himself back to do it. But that but that's the bullshit though to me. That's that's the bullshit. So but why how, even why okay. even all right? So hey, there's okay, a, how about this? What if he fights two more fights and then he fights the guy that Canelo just fought and he beats the guy that Canelo just fought? He's not gonna beat. The guy. I, I don't think so either. I, but I'm just saying. That's what I'm saying, I'm bro. Saying, like what he's gonna do? He's gonna yeah. test himself, and if he fails, he does, then though. then you were right. And but what, but what like I'm saying is at least had the balls to go and try to do it at an actual. Well, we go two and one in the next uh, three years. This is what I'm saying. You this, think he deserves a fight with? Canelo? I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. He's, made, he's this bringing a new aspect of being a boxer. Shouts out to the Paul brothers because they're hoodwinking America. And, and the whole boxing community. If y'all don't believe that, I know so you believe it. Is your I, more I, the I know you the line? Is it more the cut in the line factor? Yes, that, bro. Yes. But okay. But you didn't have a problem with what we were talking about last week with Conor McGregor coming back from that leg injury. <laughs> no, 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 and no, no, automatically no, no. having a, a title shot. You're no. like, you said that's where the money is. Yeah, you no, did. That's that. exactly. I, what no, I, I, I have a. I have a. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Time out, time out. I said that's where the money is because. He is the money fight. Of course, if I'm a fighter, if I'm a fighter and I, I'm up there and I'm, I'm champion, right? I'm champion, right? And I say, okay, this up and coming fighter wants to uh, wants to fight me, wants my belt, but I'm only gonna get like a hundred thousand, a hundred, a hundred k from him. But if I fight Connor again, I'm gonna get three mil. 
What, what fight am I gonna take? Okay, it's the same thing the same with Canelo. Take, yeah. Because oh who? That's a million dollar fight. Right 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 hey, who? Right 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 Canelo right has Floyd right Mayweather right in a fight to make that big of a payday. Does he have Pacquiao in a fight to make that big of a payday? He has nobody in that weight class that he has a big enough name that's gonna get him that money. That's different though. What I'm saying is, for Jake Paul to sit here and be like, you know what? Bring me Canelo. <laughs> you know? Serve him on the platter for me. <laughs> I'm going to whoop his ass. I didn't even say he said I'm going to whoop his but ass. But what Alex was saying is interesting because Jake Paul could go through the ranks, fight 20 nobodies, and still be beating the people he's fighting now. You know, well, he listen, could just waste time. But listen, listen. I'm not even going to look at Alex when I say this. <laughs> Alex knows once he comes into a real fighter, once he comes into yep. a real fight, he's going to get his ass whooped. He, he Alex knows He's it. picking his yeah. fight. Alex knows I, it. I know that. Alex yeah. knows it. But what I'm saying is they're hood winking everybody. All, all you got to do. All, I even all the dude that just fought last night. Logan uh, Paul. Uh, what's his name? No. What's the dude that just fought last night? Charlo. You think he can beat? Uh, Hell no. Bro, I don't Charlo. even think he can beat hot sauce. That's I don't even think he can beat yeah. hot sauce. Right up the street. Uh, he, in, he, in he, won't, he won't be. We here. talked about that. Yeah, he get. It would be yeah. interesting to see. He he get so so but here's Jake the Paul. thing: is what you're not thinking about too is himself. the reason why it makes it a little bit more interesting. Jake Paul, six one, uh, 210, 220 pounds. Yeah, Canelo guy. is five eight. Yeah. 170, 170 168. Most. 168 is what he's fighting at right now, wow. and so. What Jake Paul said is he's gonna cut down because he said Canelo's gonna fight. We'll probably fight him at 170. He's gonna cut down to 170, gain all that weight up, and he's gonna give him. He's gonna pretty much do what his brother did. The reason why Floyd had more problems with Logan than what you're used to seeing is because Jake weight. Logan is uh, 220 pounds, and what he even said he goes every single time me and Floyd wrapped up, I just dead weight just <laughs> lit, laid on him because Floyd's not used to carrying around 230 pounds and. It's that's just being dead weight, and that's why. Tired that's why Floyd. That's why yeah. Floyd straight up said he goes. He it was it was uh, he was better than I expected, and he, he was like wow. it was a hard. He was like he did he showed me something that I wasn't I wasn't that's ready for. It was because he was leaning that weight. That's why Floyd seemed more tired at the end of this fight. So is that that rumor fights. bullshit that was going around that like Floyd knocked Logan out? Yeah, he was holding it, him it, up. It's because he was Logan was just so laying more of a strategy. Time. Yeah, exactly. He wasn't knocked out to tire Floyd out. Wow. Listen, that's listen, interesting. Listen. And so that's what he's gonna try to do, Canelo. But Canelo's gonna sleep him. Yeah, Canelo's gonna Canelo sleep him. Canelo's nasty, man. Canelo's not gonna fight him. Hey, if the money, if the money if the said right. Canelo would, and see Floyd, you tell me if you, you tell me if you had a chance Canelo to make like five hundred, yeah, five hundred million off this fight, you want to take it? Five hundred million. That's a lot of cash. Whoa. That, that's how much you make for fights. Listen, for these guys, I mean, these you want to take that fight? Too. Answer that question. Would you take that fight? The, other, the big contracts and other sports, shots, but like fight sports, yeah. you make that in one night. I watched a man. I watched a man named Logan Paul get in the get in the ring with an undefeated champion and throw the wildest punches. <laughs> he did. And then after the he fight, did. he. Was like he was just, uh, just technique, just on point. Yeah, but when he but got in the ring, he was a great defensive boxer. <laughs> Boy, bro, you know he was doing hey, that, bro. That, that all goes with the experience. You, it's the experience of being in the fight because you can train for months, but if you haven't actually been on the stage, once you have lights on you, bro, it, it's pretty much like whenever Drew goes and performs, yeah, you can so practice you all the time. The, but once yeah, you get there, you have to have like a tunnel vision yeah, it clicks to in. block it all bro, out. Listen, so it's, I, and I don't even think he was thinking that. I think he was thinking, all right, five minutes. <laughs> Keep him <laughs> up. <laughs> Whew, I got through that round. All right. It, it, Another five minutes, 500 mil, baby. 500 mil. Yeah. Because you have, to, you have to be able to control yourself to not try Hold to burn yourself. Well, they're, they're, they're just, they're just hoodwinking everybody, bro. Just they hood are. Winking, hoodwinking everybody, bro. Well, and we watched a clip yesterday at the taco place, and... There was like some behind the scenes footage or whatever where Logan was like, alright champ, chill, chill, it's an exhibition, like chill. <laughs> Man, it, it's just... The I, money's there. Yeah, it... I get the cut in the line. I, I don't... I, I get and that I, and I, that, see, like, I hate that the most out of everything. I, but I, I, that's why I hate it whenever Connor fought Floyd. Yeah. yeah. Even no, though I no, went to I, Vegas, I really hated that too. Because I felt I like it that. was like uh, Hulk versus Rambo. You know what I mean? Like, it, just some bullshit. You know what I mean? But, I mean, didn't... Did Muhammad Ali fight a wrestler? Yeah, yeah. he did. So I mean, did you, he really? You yeah. can't you can't really knock you know what I mean? exhibition. You can't really knock 
knock a lot of the shit that's going on. I just, you know, see, I, there's so much more money in it nowadays yeah, that yeah. it's like. That's where and, money's at. I'm gonna do it. I mean, sh- I said shots out to them. They're, they're making a bag. You know what I mean? They're securing the bag that way. I, I just hate it. And, it's, and like it's a way for, this is another way for like the old fighters that like blew their money, mm-hmm. like Mike Tyson <laughs> and true. them like that to yeah. make another payday. Yeah. yeah. They're doing exhibitions no, to where they're not. Uh, <laughs> I think Mike the, Tyson's good, but that, yeah, you're right. I mean, look, Oscar yeah. De La Hoya coming out of retirement. Yeah. Dude, I did not know Dana White and Oscar De La Hoya. But they did like not like that. Like, I could no, I was gonna tell Jorge Ben trying to call out Dana White for a fight. But really? It's because he knows he'll massacre him. Yeah. Dana White uh, and like uh, Dana Tino White Ortiz uh, yeah? uh, were supposed to fight a long time ago. They yeah. did a whole show about it and everything. Word? And at the end, uh, Tino, Tino, Tino Ortiz didn't, didn't show up. Yeah, Dana <laughs> White. He didn't show up to the fight. Dana White was gonna put them hands on him. Yeah. <laughs> like, you really think Dana White will put them hands on him? I don't know. Dana White been around and he might, I don't know. We might, Dan White probably got some hands we don't never know about. Not for you, gotta watch out. You can't never That's underestimate. True. I don't think it would be, be a best, boxing uh, instructor. To be a fucking yeah, boxing yeah, instructor yeah, in Las something. Vegas, uh, an aerobics instructor, and then he just, you know, he grew up with the Fertitta brothers, the two billionaires mm-hmm. in Vegas. They own all the casinos, like, like oh, a lot shit. of the casinos oh, wow. in Vegas. They own the Palms, they just sold it for billions of dollars. Damn. So, uh, what he did is uh, he grew up with them in high school. And those were his best friends. He saw that the UFC was being sold by the Gracie family for a million dollars. He told them he was like, "Hey, we got to get we, this. We, gotta, we should get this. It's a good investment." He goes, "I'll help run it and everything." Yeah. And uh, they bought it for a million dollars and ended up selling it for four point two billion. Yeah. Oh just my a few years gosh. ago. Gosh, that's amazing, bro. Come up. Just and little risks like that, like what we were talking about. He got a big per- percentage of it, bro, even though little, it was none of his money. Little things, bro, can change your whole yep. trajectory. It's crazy. Yeah. Little risks, a little chances, risks, a little risks, yeah, risks, 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 risks. 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 <laughs> that's all we were saying. Risks, risks, risks. Nah, but nah, but, but uh, that's real though. That's, that's, that's crazy. Something I, that's something I'm going through right now. Um, I'm going for broke right now, bro. Like when I said going for broke, I'm I mean, in like, there. It's a, lot it of, the it's a lot of stuff I'm putting like in perspective, like in front of me, like as far as businesses, and, and this too. Like I'm working on some stuff I, I haven't told you. y'all about, like for here that'll kind of propel us up there. But I'm man, I'm all in. Rich is it? Like all? Oh, like, that's how it's good. Just all in. Yeah. Hey man, y'all, hey y'all better not steal our like shit, uh, man. Risk is for real. Risk no, for real. Good last week. When you say, when you say risk is, I mean like I'm gonna spell it though. Really, we got we got risk Like really, really risk is, and, and man, this is a broken one. But that's what that's what you gotta do. Yeah, I mean you gotta take the risk. My nigga say all in, all in on yourself. Big facts. I like that though. That's a good way to end it. Yeah, that's a good way to end it. We can wrap up, baby. We can wrap up. Appreciate y'all. Peace.